Hi, welcome to Hazel's Muppet Show edition of Hazel's Way. I know there's some crazy people around here, and but I'm kind of concerned as to who's going to jump out and what's going to happen. But if you're here, I'm playing the Muppet Show theme for very good reason. My opinion is this. Take a look at the Count Von Count from Sesame Street. Take a look at Randy Orton. They're one and the same person. I think I have a Muppet behind me. I'm not entirely sure and it's quite scary. But going on. If you actually look at the WWE roster, half of them look like they're working part time for the Muppet show. Now, the weirdness in this house continues. My thing for this week is Smackdown, ECW and Raw are coming to Wisconsin. We got people going to see Raw in Green Bay. We have a whole big group of us, second row. I will say it again, second row at the SmackDown event. We have one person to thank for that, the Jammy Git who got to the, managed to get number four, JP. But he is a god in the sense that he did get us our second row tickets for the show. Those of you who know our show know that Josh and Robert crawling on their hands and knees across the floor is a typical event in one of our shows. But it also brings me on to other things. If you're going to have somebody on the roster, such as John Cena, play at being injured, you need to keep them injured in all aspects. I've just been online looking for pictures and I've just found some recent ones of John Cena getting ready for his new movie role. Doesn't work well with this injured persona that he's doing where Big Show came out took advantage of the fact that he is injured, etc, etc. It's not good. The other thing is, is that I have to agree with the Miz, too many people are doing the same main events. It's always the same people over and over and over again. And it would be nice to see the likes of Kofi Kingston that go against the Miz, that kind of thing. Get some of the younger guys in, get some of the different faces in for the main events. Now, you'll be maybe wondering why I keep looking at the TV because I'm actually watching Edge and CM Punk wrestle right now, which brings us on to the other topic. There's going to be a feature coming up that we are doing in regards to certain characters shall we say in the media world who may look like certain wrestlers for example we've already had Randy Orton Count Von Count Ted DiBiase and Cody Rhodes Beaker and I can't see he's in the head he's in the house rather he's not in my head that's the voices. They are in my head. They counsel me and they understand. Um, but, but on that note, I'm going to cut now because it's Mother's Day. I've had two gin and tonics, very, very strong, and I'm half buzzed. But on a really, really serious note, a very, very, very good friend of wrestling fans speak out, Becky, lost her grandma over the past couple of days and all of us send her our best wishes and our heart and love go out to her and her family so that's hazel's way cutting out for now bye bye you can film the weirdos now